morning everybody what is up welcome back to my channel welcome back to another moving vlog First morning I woke up alone in New York City. My mom left yesterday, so we're picking the vlog back up. We're obviously not just moving, but there's a lot of stuff going on for my apartment this week, and I just thought it made sense to call this moving vlog. But we're also doing fun things. So right now I am just packing a bag. Me, Brooke, and Emma, who's our graphic designer, creative director, literally so many things for gals on the go. She's incredible, I love her. She lives here in the city. Me, Brooke, and her now live in the same city, so instead of doing our Zoom meetings like we usually do, we're gonna meet in person, which I'm so excited about. We have lots on the docket for what we're talking about. We're working on a Gals on the Go website, so she's showing us kind of the final product for that today. Working on merch, working on a branding shoot, other ideas, so many things that we've saved for this meeting today. So we'll probably be there for a hot minute. We're going to a place called Charlie Street, for like, mm, sounds of the city. I tried to dress up a little, Brooke said she was wearing like a little dress and sneakers, so I was like, I will wear a little dress and sneakers. I was about to go there in a more casual outfit, so I'm excited though, more more fun. I totally need to be walking out of my apartment in like a minute, so that's that. Spray some perfume, a little, little vetiver, love it. Just wearing this dress from ASOS, I love it. It's like a little wrap dress with a collar, I like the color. Very fun, just like a little linen guy, and I'm gonna put on my Nike Air Force Ones. Just did my hair at the Dyson Air app. Let's go meet up with Brooke and then Emma. The gals are on the go. On the move already. Ugh. Oh my god, no way! Oh my we just met a subscriber, so that was awesome. Shout out to Emily. We are walking to Charlie Street right now. It is already hot and it's not even 10 a.m. yet, yeah. so that's terrifying. It's gonna be a warm a um, warm day, but yes. we're gonna get lots done. Early gals, let's do it. Ooh, bright. The Gals in the Go team is back together. Cheers. For the first time ever, actually. Yeah, so crazy. Love it. Food time. Yay. We all got some sort of egg and toast and avo situation. Yay. We are now at Bluestone Lane <laughs> because the other place didn't have Wi-Fi. So we just caught up and now we're gonna get down to it. This is really beautiful and they have like a little bar. I like it in here. The vibes are right. Down to business, baby. Back now, such a productive meeting. We literally were there for four hours, five hours maybe, going on five, I can't remember. Um, I just pulled my hair back and put a t-shirt on as soon as I walked in. It is so, so hot outside and I'm so used to the humidity of being in Florida, but it's just so weird at being this hot in New York, if that makes sense. But. I know I'm gonna be complaining when it's cold, so whatever. I have a couple hours before I'm heading to dinner. We're going to Balthazar tonight. I've always wanted to go. Brooke and I are meeting with someone from Podcast One, our podcast network. Really, really excited to start meeting people in person again. And we've never really met anyone that we work with at Podcast One in person. Like, this is so crazy. So one of the benefits of living in New York, people live here, people visit here all the time. And it's just really, really exciting. And we came up with so many great ideas for Girls on the Go working on like a video component, so many things. But yeah, we got some things in the mail, of course. That's just gonna happen the next few days. Um, what do I have to show you guys? This area is coming along nicely. My toaster came in the mail. I've had my eye on this toaster for like a year now. I almost got it for our senior year apartment in college, but Delaney had a toaster already. Um, so now I don't have one. So I got this one off of Amazon. It's the Revolution Toaster. I will link it down below for you guys. So you can pick, you know, let's just say it's because I'm a big toast person. I use toasters a lot and I like to reheat things in here. It's just, I found like this was the best idea. And I asked, Julia Havens has this and I texted her and she said she loves it. So it's not overhyped. You can say, you know, how crispy you want your bread if you want it burnt. Like literally what you want it to look like. You can choose bagel, waffle pastry, English muffin. I mean, you can't get better than that. And it has two slots, super sleek looking. And um, the cords were kind of annoying me. So I just put my salt and pepper right there. 
Um, I don't know, I think this works for now. When I get my Nespresso, I'll probably put it right there. So this will be like big appliance area. I definitely wanna keep this more clear. Um, this will be more organized. I'm just figuring everything out still. As soon as I got back, I like lit all of my candles because I want it to just smell amazing in here. I have a lot to do. I really need to unpack my clothes still and I can't do it at night because I don't have any lights in my bedroom, but I'm so tired right now and I know tonight's gonna be, you know, like we're gonna be having a lot of conversations and I need to be very engaged. So I wanna kind of recharge right now. So I'm gonna take another shower. Like I'm probably gonna take another shower tonight. Like I shower so much here because it's so hot. And then I think I'm gonna get in bed because I don't have a couch yet. <laughs> and watch like some White Lotus or Ted Lasso something and just chill out for a little bit, let my phone charge. My phone battery dies so fast here. Um, and I really do need to um, book my task grab at someone to come and hang out my TV. So I definitely wanna start watching TV. That sounds fun. I hate watching it on my laptop. And my Wi-Fi is coming next Tuesday finally. So I still have to wait a little bit, but that's okay. Yeah, that's the update. I don't know if you guys knew this, but my microwave is actually hidden in here, which is nice. It gives a very sleek look in here. I just heated up literally the last little bit of my Chipotle I had last night. Bringing it to bed. And we're gonna watch some White Lotus. Put this green blanket down so I don't spill on my white new Brooklyn in sheets. I need my LaCroix. I can't wait till I have nightstands and a bed frame and all the things, but this works for now. All right guys, I just watched a little bit of episode four of White Lotus. That show is just so good and so enticing, like wow. I took another shower and I fixed my hair. I redid my makeup completely. I washed my face the whole nine yards. Um, I really like my outfit tonight. Like I said, we're going to Balthazar. I'm so excited I've never been. So Brooke and I are about to meet up and then walk over to Soho area and meet up with Sue. So it's super flowy and honestly, these are a couple things that aren't in those two suitcases. Like I said, I just have a couple random clothing items um, besides the suitcase open, which is all my active wear and I just don't wanna open those suitcases till I'm ready to unpack them. I know it's so bad. But both the skirt and shirt are from Revolve. I don't really know if this goes or not, but it just feels right. It's flowy, it's fun, feels very Balthazar. I love it, it's just this fun little yellow top, perfect for summer, very flattering too. If I had a pair of jeans that I wanted to wear with it right now, I would. I just don't feel like opening my suitcase, I'm being lazy. Skirt, also from Revolve. I feel like I'm gonna wear this a lot the next few weeks. And then my sneakers are All Saints. Added this necklace to my normal everyday. Jewelry is normal. <laughs> um, just necklace is from Orium. And earrings are from Argento Vivo. This is from Argento Vivo and this I don't remember. So let's go to Balthazar. Just having a moment today. We are. We are. Ah! I have to You guys, I'm back. Brooke and I ended up going to a pub on our way back, because literally, why not? We had such a great dinner. We were there for three hours at a count. I am not crying, um, even though I have been crying a lot this week, because I'm just so thankful. Um, I just had something in my eye, and I started crying. Um, I just like can't believe I live in New York City. I'm gonna be annoying about that for a minute, but it's like, <sighs> we went to Balthazar. Like we just went to dinner tonight with someone that works at our podcast network. We like went to dinner tonight and now we're like best friends with Sue from Podcast One. We love her. And then we just walked back and walked into a pub and then I said, okay, good night, Brooke. See you tomorrow. Like, what the heck? This is so cool. I love this. Um, and I'm just gonna like get in bed. Well, actually, no, I'm about to take my third shower of the day. day. I'm a little tipsy, I'm sorry. You guys like, I'm not even kidding. I'm literally about to take my third shower of the day because I feel gross. The city is hot. I'm gonna get wet, watch a little White Lotus, pop some melatonin, go to sleep. Um, I got more packages, of course, <laughs> um, but I just was not in the mood to bring them up. I think I got my kitchen trash can. Nothing crazy exciting anyways. Actually, I think my floor lamp for my living room has come, which is important because I don't have light in my bedroom or my living room. I'm in a shower and then get in bed. I'm so sleepy. And I'll see you guys in the morning. I could not get out of bed so I had to play some music. Good morning. 
Also, I think it's a hat day today. <laughs> Hey guys, we're headed uptown. I'm meeting with Kenzie, Kenzie Elizabeth. I'm so excited she's in town. We're recording with her, with her for Gals and Go podcast today, but her and I are meeting for like coffee brunch beforehand. Here's my little outfit of the day. It's a bad hair day, so top is Aritzia. Jeans are Princess Polly. Got my Chanel bag that I got at Agora Vintage in Athens. Hot Yankees jewelry, normal. No, I'm kidding. Well, actually, it is my normal jewelry. And then I'm wearing my new... Jordans got them off of um, Farfetch and they're green and it just makes sense, right? So we're gonna go, we're gonna take the train, we're gonna be responsible queens and only spend two dollars and seventy-five cents instead of like a thirty dollar Uber. So pretty proud of myself. Let's go. Here I am with my amazing brunch babe. Look at it. I know. I can't believe you're here right now. It's such a great welcome. Love it. Yay. I know. Isn't this so cute? This is so, so cool. Let's just strike this one and she can sit there so we can have a clear shot to you if that's cool. How was your morning, guys? We had a lovely morning. What's it? I just like this is so cool. We just went down the road. Uh, Chick fil A time, baby. Brooke was like, I want Chick fil A. We just recorded. I've never been to a Chick-fil-A in New York City. Guys, how funny is this? This is literally how my trash can came in the mail. And I just took it out of the box downstairs, but I got like a cord cover for my TV because I'm mounting it tomorrow, finally. Very exciting. Um, but yeah, I thought that was funny. They just have like this shipping label up here. Today's things I got in the mail, I got these glass straws from Amazon. Pretty pumped. They have some that are straight and then some that are um, whatever, slanted. Excited, gonna wash those. Today has been the most chaotic day. Just have this casual ladder right here. I, um, if this is not what New York life is like, like I'm honestly here for it. It's chaotic energy. Like I have 10 to 11 tabs open in my brain right now and that's completely okay. Whew, I'm just like, oh my goodness. I'm like on the phone with Brooke. We're trying, we literally live so close, but we were already together. So we were like, okay, let's just talk on the phone, think this through. And then I'll like get a call from DoorDash downstairs saying my bedding is delivered. So then I go downstairs. And then while I'm coming up, the management team of my apartment calls back. So I'm trying to get a storage locker downstairs, put my suitcases and just other random stuff in there because I don't have any room in here, which is a great service that they have. As I'm coming up, the superintendent was like, hey, here's that ladder you need because I have a task for it coming tomorrow to help me hang up stuff. Um, and then my phone tells me that my Wi Fi hotspot is about to be done for the month because that's what I've been using on my computer because I don't have the Wi Fi because I have to wait till Tuesday. And then I have to call Brooke back because we're trying to figure out something for the podcast and we're trying to get office space, which I'm so excited. <sighs> Believe it or not, I've had one cup of coffee this morning. It's like crazy, but I love this. I love the rush. I'm so happy. Just now it's so chaotic. Margo, Kenzie, and Katie are coming over tonight to see my apartment. And it's quite frankly a mess right now because I just. And I unboxed something from CB2 and it was broken, which happens, it's okay, but now I have to like send this back and you know. I'm also really pumped. I just got a Fitbit that is Alexa enabled. Love that, so I'm charging that right now. Um, I just thought I'd document this moment. This is all good things. Like I honestly love this chaotic energy. I love it. I just love being here, being so close to people. And I'm so thankful to, just for everything. This is just so crazy. So I thought I'd update you guys. Got this moss or fake moss from uh, Amazon to put on my plant over there. So I'm gonna try to do it now. I don't know what I'm doing, you guys. <laughs> Me trying to, we have moss, you guys. I <laughs> Sierra's probably gonna laugh when she comes to see my apartment. And she's like, what did you do with the moss? I mean, there can't be too much of a perfect way to do that. I just put it on top. Yeah, it looks good. Could be real. No one needs to know. I can't keep real plants alive, so this is what we're working with. My bedding you came, guys, and I just gotta say, living in New York has its perks because I got same-day delivery. I literally ordered it this morning. I guess it just got shipped from the Macy's in New York. It's got a great handle. I've had bedding from the hotel collection before, and I just know this just feels so good. I just wanted simple white bedding, nothing crazy. Eventually gonna get some throw pillows, um, so I'm gonna gonna put this on my bed. I'm so excited. I didn't make my bed this morning, okay? Um, to have some actual bedding. I've been using these Barefoot Dreams blankets, which are awesome, but um, nothing like some nice bedding. So I'm gonna make my bed because I have some friends coming over tonight to see the place. It'll be nice to add that little touch. 
Why was that so hard? I just realized this didn't come with shams. I think I had to buy that separately. Silly me. Um, but it's just hard because this is like not on a bed frame and it's so low to the ground right now. So, and like tucking it all under. But yeah, I'll let you guys know how it is after I sleep, but looks just exactly what I want. It's super wrinkly right now, but I guess that'll just have to do. Me trying to adult is the funniest thing ever. Just added my throw blankets to the end of the bed. These will go in my living room when I have my couch, but for now this will have to do. I'm out of breath, oh my gosh. All right, next up on things I want to work on, I have just been like <laughs> in a rush every day and haven't had time to organize. So I've just been like getting ready and then throwing stuff places. But um, as you guys can see, I got this little storage cart. I wanna organize this a little bit right now, at least put this stuff in there. Cause as I showed you guys, I really just have this one drawer working on getting some over the toilet storage um, and potentially something here, we're not really sure. What I'm thinking is this can be hair. This is like my everyday makeup bag. It doesn't really change. And then random, I don't really know. We're gonna see as I go. All right, so this is what I did for now. Um, just so, cause I have guests coming, I just wanted that out of the way. But this will probably be edited honestly or changed because I also, like I've showed you guys, do have this storage back here. I just am trying, I think I want skincare in here. And I was able to fit my makeup pouch in that drawer. Soap for the sink, perfumes, hair tools, hair products, random products, and hair ties and stuff. And then just miscellaneous down there. And then I can just, push that guy back. Um, so it's not like the cleanest look, but I think it's better. And again, just for storage, boom. More things are here. I need to turn more lights on. First up, I got this cause I had something like this in Athens and used it all the time. It's just like a ton of little things you could possibly need. Like little hooks, push pins, just random stuff. It's great for hanging up stuff. And I just have a feeling this will come in handy. Finally got some scissors because I've just been using Sierra's box cutters that she left for me. These just are that. This I'm going to put in my shower. It's a little shower caddy that um, I'm going to stick to the wall or suction, I suppose, um, and put products. Believe it or not, I only have three mugs here. So I bought this set of clear mugs. I love it. I, I will link all these things down below, like anything I show in this video, I'll try and link. So I've got these and I decided to go with these instead of the ones that are like hollow and double walled because they don't do well in the dishwasher. They get kind of foggy throughout the time. So I have four of these. I got some shot glasses for ginger shots, fireball shots, any kind of shots you want. I've got, um, I just got four of those. And then I got a hamper. These are like the foldable ones, but they just fit so well in closets. You can kind of squish them around if need be. So yeah, that's in now. I just cleaned my apartment and brought all the boxes to the package room because I just want it to be all nice in here, so now I have to do that again. We're, get, we're getting things together, you guys. We're getting things together. This is the most beautiful dinner I think I've ever had in my entire life. <laughs> this is a Trader Joe's chicken burrito. I just heated it up. I'm gonna eat this guy before the gals get here. I'm gonna turn these lanterns on so when it gets dark, I have these lanterns going because I still don't have my floor lamp in. But I'm just trying to set the vibes. It's so funny, everyone I've like, I've only had a couple people here so far and I'm like, sorry, it's messy. And they're like, Danielle, you literally just moved in here. Like I thought it was gonna be way messier. And I'm like over here trying to entertain and make it cute. But in reality, that's just not gonna happen. There's gonna be boxes and stuff everywhere. But I just, I love having people over. It's so fun and I want them to like it as much as I do. <laughs> and I love these cause they're obviously not real flame and they flicker. Nice, very cozy, very fun. All right, Margo will be here soon. I finally cleaned up the card table. Looks good in here for now. Bedroom, I will unpack. I promise I will. It's just been a busy few days. Exciting, of course. Kind of want to like have music going. I'm being so nerdy right now. I'm like, oh my God. Bathroom looks nice and cozy. So happy I got that done. It's just such a good feeling. Oh, she might have just texted me. Um, I think I'm gonna get my little speaker and Play some music. Furniture updates, I think we found something for that little entryway. I cannot, that little entryway right there. You guys all gave me some great suggestions. We found this like, it's not a locker, but it's kind of that style. It's just like an entryway 
cabinet i think from west elm that's completely closed and when you open it there's spaces for baskets i'm gonna hang a hook on the side and that'll be good so i can put like some of my favorite pairs of shoes up there or things i use a lot or like these grocery bags i have right here i guess if i need to use the breaker though i have to make sure i can move that piece of furniture but yeah waiting on the floor lamp that's gonna go right there obviously waiting on my couch which who knows waiting on my bed frame and my two nightstands that i'm so excited for another plant will go right here with my suitcases suitcases will be gone on monday i just got the lease for my storage locker that i got downstairs these baskets i've said before will go under here um i have some more things for this area coming this is for that plant this is for a vase that's gonna go here no tv in here thinking about getting like a little iphone projector too could be fun. The only thing about this mirror being here is when I take alpha pictures, the lighting's coming from behind me. So I don't know. I don't really think it could go anywhere else. So that's the update. Oh, and then obviously these chairs will be going here when I get my table. So look who's here. Hello, hello. We have another guest. Hi. Sorry. <laughs> this is Morgan. Katie brought me this. The only appropriate. I love this. I'm so happy. Whatever. <laughs> Guys, I'm like smiling from ear to ear. My world's just collided. I had Kenzie, Margo, Katie here, and Kenzie's friend Jess. And then my friend Morgan from high school came. And it was just so cool to like have, I mean, obviously some of them know each other, but then having Morgan meet like my friends that I've met through social media that now are literally my real friends. Now we all like made plans to hang out together this weekend. It's just so nice when your friends all vibe and like it was so cool. It just we it kind of started out as just oh let's go let's come see Danielle's apartment and then we like were just all talking for so long. They stayed, they just left, it's like eleven o'clock. And they all got here on like eight and I just pulled out whatever I had in my fridge. I just pulled out my pretzels, hummus, cucumbers, like I just really tried. And like when Morgan left, we were like, this is our life now. Like see you later. Like New York is such a cool place and I haven't like I'm just I, I, I don't know and I'm like I was just on the phone with Brian he's packing because he this is his second to last night in Georgia he's moving on Saturday morning it's Thursday now it's just so so freaking crazy yeah I'm gonna go to bed I'm well no I'm about to take a shower my second shower of the day yesterday I took three wash my face get in bed I'm so excited to see how I like sleeping with this new comforter I will update you guys tomorrow and yeah love you guys so much good night New York City. Friday, you guys, the new comforter passed the vibe check. I slept incredible. It's not a duvet, by the way, it's comforter, so I don't have to put an insert in. I don't mind duvets, like I love sleeping with them. I just don't always love owning them because I hate washing them. And I know I'm gonna have to wash this a lot because it's white and I'm clumsy. Like that's just bound to happen. Like taking out the insert and putting it back in, not not for me. This is just easier and it felt like a duvet. It was so comfortable, it was so cooling. Ugh, review is good. I'll link this bedding. Breakfast time, I'm gonna use the new toaster. <laughs> I will also link this down below. Um, it's from Amazon. So funny, I like posted on my Snapchat story and a ton of my friends thought that I was at Panera. going through my planner right now and I thought I'd give you a lay of the land for the day because it's a busy one so this way if you see random things happening during the vlog you'll understand why so we're getting ready right now we're not getting ready I should be getting ready right now I have a wax at European wax center at 10 30 driver at 12 o'clock I'm so excited Brooke and I are going because we have um Keaton's birthday dinner tonight I haven't washed my hair since I think Saturday or Sunday and it's Friday and it lasts because having extensions. So if I can just get a blowout and make it last the best because I hate washing my hair. 1 p.m. we're going to tour an office space or potential studio space for Gals on the Go. Brooke and I are just going to go straight from the dry bar. So excited about that. Hopefully we can find something we like because we want to completely redo it. We want to, you know, paint the walls, the whole nine yards. Um, we'll kind of tell you guys more about that one together maybe. <clears throat> but... We're gonna tour that and then at 2 p.m. I have a task rabbit coming here that I was telling you guys about to help me hang up some stuff and then I forget what time Keaton's birthday dinner. Keaton's in town um, for her birthday. If you guys don't, I mean, you probably know her. She makes YouTube videos as well. Keaton Milburn. 
Um, I have it down to seven. So um, we're going to Beauty in Essex tonight. So I'm really excited. I think it's um, me, Brooke, Kenzie, Margot, Keaton, and Kit. And maybe, I think Keaton's boyfriend too. So it'll be a really fun little group. I'm so excited. And yeah, I'm just not showing my face because I look bad if you can't tell. But yeah, I'm just planning out the day, listening to my coffee house playlist. It's gonna be a big gal on the go day. All right, you guys, we've got about a 25 minute walk ahead of us. These walks are a huge workout, so and I'm so happy about it. So I'm just wearing this set because I'm sure it's hot as heck outside. It's a little set active, biker short set, my Air Force Ones bun let's go get waxed baby Woo! this is my fourth one and it gets easier every time so we are almost there you guys this walk has honestly been amazing solid 20 minutes i love walking everywhere you see so many things <laughs> you guys i was in and out of there in 15 minutes i swear everything's faster in new york I'm gonna try out this place called noho juice bar guys this is so good there's so many places to get fresh juices like literally the local bodegas this is so fresh I love it just came back took a shower really quick I had to change because I was so sweaty this set is from beyond yoga I also love it switch to this little belt fanny I don't really know this little belt bag is that what it's called got my Fitbit on um, I am headed to the dry bar I haven't been in so so long I couldn't even tell you the last time I've been um, so I'm really really excited. I'm meeting Brooke there. I'm so excited to have my hair done It is waiting for it. It is waiting for the dry bar I've never been to the dry bar with hair extensions So I just had to like I think I have to pay a little bit extra because someone has to know how to work with extensions I don't really know. I'm so excited I'm gonna start walking over there now and then we're gonna come back meet the task grab at dry bar Oh my gosh, I can hardly wait. I'm screaming. I'm quaking. I'm so excited. It's about to be so magical in there Fresh out of the dry bar Good morning. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Brooke finished way before me because I have extensions I started now. early though. She did start early, but. And she, they could do mine in, I feel like, a solid like 45. Yeah, no, I do miss those days. I've never got, went to the dry bar with extensions, but she did a great job. We, Brooke got us some goods from yeah. Ludlow Coffee Supply. Trying another yeah. coffee shop in the area. It's good, I like it. And now, we're off to visit a studio space. A studio. Oh, yeah. I said I called it an office. Office. I said office earlier. Now I just yeah. said studio. But yeah, excited. I like this. Is there Wi-Fi? I assume. Yes. Okay. Cool. So. So we could, if you wanted to get in soon, we can always get you situated in a different office, and then okay. we can move you to that office. Yeah. Um, oh but it's, it's pretty much the exact same. Hey guys, so much to update you on. One. Brooke and I toured a couple spaces and they were great options, really, really happy. Hopefully gonna tour a couple more, we're just getting after it, but the place we saw today, we can completely customize, we can paint it, we can add soundproof, like everything. And I guess the people that were in that before us also did a podcast, so we know it's suitable for podcasts. So I'm so excited, that was so much fun. And then I rushed back here and I have updates for my apartment. Anything look different over here? We have a TV folks. <laughs> the remote's really cool too. I don't have Wi-Fi yet, so there's not much to do. Um, but it is cool. Well, I guess I'll show you guys. It's kind of like a Wii. You can either like obviously use the buttons to go up or down, or you can move it around um, as like a cursor. Really funny, and it has airplay too, which will be really nice, but you need Wi-Fi for that, so I can't do it. One thing I can do with, so this isn't the Samsung Frame TV, which a lot of people talk about. This is an LG, but it also offers the same like art gallery so I can just have this up. It kind of looks like a painting, which I think is really pretty. And it switches off, um, there's my little cursor guy. Um, and it shows Van Gogh. And then there's like different ones that you can download if I just don't have Wi-Fi. So I think this is absolutely beautiful. Just if I want to have my TV on, like this is so pretty. High tech for sure. Uh, so I thought I'd give this little TV a shout out. Um, so that's set up. It was such a seamless process. Andre on TaskRabbit is the best. He was so great. I I felt bad. I was like, can I help you? And he's like, no. Like I, I'm just so like having people help me is the weirdest thing to me in a really cool way. 
but I don't know. I just felt bad, but honestly, he did better without me probably. Um, I just kind of helped. I told him like Sierra helped me. Like she was like, your TV should probably be six to eight inches above your dresser. So that's what we went for a super sleek TV, and I bought this Amazon cord cover. Um, it's so cheap. It has adhesive, and you just put it over the cord. Um, so he helped me with that as well. So that's one piece. Then I finally have light, you guys. It's such a big deal. These are the Ikea Tora Red lamps, and they look, I feel like they look uneven, but then when you stand in front of it, it's not. Um, and he showed me, it'd be like this laser level thing. It was so cool that they are completely even. So hopefully it's just me that thinks that, because I mean, I can move them. They're just, you literally hang them up and plug them in. There was no intense electrical work. But I'm so happy. I actually got these light bulbs. Well, let me just show you guys. It comes with a little remote. I was inspired because some of my friends have colored light bulbs. And they'll, I think even Brooke does it where they have like red at night and stuff. First off, let's just turn them on. Boom. This in itself is a game changer. I haven't really unpacked because every time I go to unpack my closet, it's nighttime and it's pitch black dark in here. So now I have light and all these colors. I'll link these light bulbs down below. But red, how sick at night. So relaxing. We've got green. I don't know if I'll really use that. Pink. They like change right after they're blue. I mean, what? It just looks so good. I'm so, so happy with it. And eventually I will have nightstands. And my bed's gonna stay pretty low. Um, I know it's low now, obviously, but once my bed frame comes, it's not much higher. Nightstand will like go right there. And it's a small nightstand, so having this hung up gives me more room on the nightstand to not have to put a lamp there, if that makes sense. So, Neil say, very, very happy. Task Rabbit is a cool thing. I'd never done it before. I'm gonna turn these off because it's, I love natural light during the day. I don't know, I'm gonna take another shower for sure. And I'm really excited because Ryan comes to New York City tomorrow. I'm so excited. So I'm having my little girls night tonight. And then he's flying in tomorrow around 11 o'clock. So he probably won't get to me until like noon. So I'll start a new vlog tomorrow. All right, outfit ended up turning out even better than expected with the green accessories. This set, you guys know it, you love it. I have it in purple. It's from Princess Polly and I just bought it in black and white. It's just so flattering. I get it in a size six. So it just has this top with the trousers. I was gonna wear heels, but I didn't get a pedicure and it's supposed to rain. So I'm bringing an umbrella as well. And I'm just wearing these Jordans with my green Balenciaga bag, jewelry. Argento Vivo is the little D one. Argento Vivo is how you say it. And then these two necklaces are Orium Collective. Argento Vivo earrings. I think I'm gonna take a little fireball shot alone before I go because why not? Because Katie um, got me a little fireball housewarming gift yesterday as you guys saw. So I thought, why not? And I have shot glasses. Might be lame to do this alone, but eh, no, I've totally done this before. Ooh, I can't even fill it up all the way to the top. All right, gotta get the carrots. Got the carrots, got the fireball. It's like we're in Athens. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, I can't believe I'm doing this. Cheers, you guys. Oh God, I'm not ready. I haven't taken fireball in a minute. This is for you, Katie Bloody. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do this now. I'm gonna do it. Cheers. Oh. Literally right after I took that shot, I go over to my phone and I have a text saying it's actually at eight, not at seven, not Keaton's fault. I just didn't see that. I thought it was at seven and I just took a fireball shot and it's like burning in my chest. And now I'm just, I'm just like, and Brooke thought it was at seven too. So I was like, come over and drink with me. <laughs> Shoot. I know, on the roof, don't text. Is this like the magical Wait, will you? With the birthday girl, hello, hello. It's grilled cheese and tomato soup in a spoon. Don't mind us just hanging in the bathroom because it's so cute. It's like a whole hang, like get away from the boys in here. Hi guys, I just got back. We had so much fun. It was just such a nice night being with everybody. And oh, I just 
you guys know I could go on my show I can't believe I live here bed because Ryan comes tomorrow but guys I literally walked to my door and there's a fresh bouquet of flowers like with the brown paper and everything and I'm like who is my secret admirer it was my new neighbor and we're friends now and she got locked out of her apartment earlier so she like came and knocked on my door and I mean I literally just gave her my phone and this was so unnecessary but she said thank you for saving me today thought you might like some fresh flowers for the new apartment welcome to New York like I love New York so sweet I am so thankful so thank you and I don't have a vase though but I have like cups and stuff I can put them in for now and then I have to go buy a vase tomorrow but yeah that ends this vlog I have no idea how long it is I hope you guys enjoyed more to come love you guys see you next time bye